Do you ever ponder about the dynamics of privilege and the complexities of motherhood? Today, we're diving into the world of Celeste Ung's Little Fires Everywhere, a novel that beautifully captures these themes and more. Set in the meticulously planned community of Shaker Heights, we are introduced to the Richardsons, a family embodying suburban prosperity, and their lives disrupted by the arrival of Mia Warren, a free spirit artist, and her daughter Pearl. At the heart of Ong's narrative is a custody battle over a Chinese-American baby, Mei Ling Chao, which draws a dividing line in this seemingly perfect community. The Richardsons and Warrens each carry their own desires, secrets and burdens, ultimately creating an intricate web of connections and conflicts. The title, Little Fires Everywhere, is a metaphor for the small, seemingly inconsequential actions that can lead to significant shifts in our lives. The collision of these two families sets the stage for a profound exploration of race, class, and the impact of well-meaning interventions. At the heart of this narrative lies a custody battle that divides a community. This struggle over the fate of Mei Ling Chao, a Chinese-American baby, serves as a catalyst, revealing deep-seated issues of privilege, identity, and motherhood within the community. Privilege, one of the central themes, manifests in the lives of the Richardson family who epitomize the idyllic suburban prosperity. Their lives, governed by order and rules, starkly contrast with Mia Warren's nomadic and unconventional lifestyle. Mia, a free-spirited artist, and her daughter Pearl become the embodiment of a life outside the carefully manicured lawns of Shaker Heights. This contrast serves to highlight the privilege that the Richardsons often take for granted. While the Richardsons enjoy the benefits of their socioeconomic status, Mia and Pearl navigate life on the periphery, constantly adapting to new environments and circumstances. The theme of privilege also comes to the fore in the custody battle over Mei Ling Chao. The wealthy white couple's desire to adopt Mei Ling, believing they can provide a better life for her, is a clear indication of their privilege. It's a stark reminder of how societal advantages can be used to control and dictate the lives of those less fortunate. Identity, another key theme in Little Fires Everywhere, is explored through the characters' struggles to define themselves and their place in the world. The Richardson children who have grown up in a world of order and predictability find themselves drawn to Mia's free-spirited nature, which challenges their preconceived notions of identity. In contrast, Mia's identity is fluid, shaped by her experiences and artistic pursuits. Pearl, Mia's daughter, is caught between her mother's nomadic lifestyle and the allure of the Richardson's stability, leading to a complex exploration of her own identity. Motherhood, a central theme in the novel, is portrayed with nuance and complexity. Elena Richardson's approach to motherhood, governed by rules and societal expectations, contrasts sharply with Mia's unconventional parenting style. The custody battle over Mei Ling Chao further complicates the concept of motherhood, exploring the idea of what makes a real mother. Is it biology, love, or the ability to provide? Ung's portrayal of motherhood challenges the conventional definitions, shedding light on the sacrifices, choices, and societal pressures women face. The different perspectives on motherhood presented in the novel prompt us to question the societal norms and expectations placed on mothers. In essence, Little Fires Everywhere is a complex tapestry of human relationships and societal norms. The themes of privilege, identity, and motherhood are intricately woven into the narrative, providing a rich, layered reading experience that resonates with readers long after the final page. The clash between Mia and Elena becomes a microcosm of the larger societal struggles surrounding identity and the consequences of imposing one's beliefs on others. As we delve further into the narrative, we'll continue to unravel the many layers of this thought-provoking novel. The characters in Little Fires Everywhere carry their own burdens, desires, and secrets. This statement rings true as we delve deeper into the intricacies of each character, their motivations, and how they embody the themes brought to life in this thought-provoking narrative. Let's begin with the Richardson family, the embodiment of suburban prosperity. At the helm is Elena Richardson, a woman who firmly believes in the orderliness of life. Elena's world is meticulously planned, and she finds comfort in the predictability of her routine. However, her seemingly perfect life masks her struggle with the societal expectations placed upon her as a mother and a woman. Her interactions with Mia Warren, the free-spirited artist, challenge her worldview and force her to confront the limitations of her privileged existence. Mia Warren, on the other hand, is a stark contrast to Elena. A nomadic artist, Mia's life is defined by constant movement and change. 
She is a woman who values freedom and creativity over stability and order. Mia's character is a potent representation of the theme of identity and the struggle against societal norms. Her relationship with her daughter Pearl also brings to the forefront the complexities of motherhood, as she battles to provide a stable life for Pearl despite their transient existence. Pearl, Mia's daughter, is a character caught in the crossfire of her mother's unconventional lifestyle and her own desire for stability. She finds solace in the Richardson family, drawn to their orderly life. Pearl's character reflects the longing for belonging and the struggle for identity, a theme that resonates strongly throughout the novel. The Richardson children, Lexi, Trip, Moody, and Izzy, each carry their own narratives. They embody the struggles of adolescence against the backdrop of privilege. Izzy, the youngest, emerges as a character who challenges the norms and expectations of her privileged upbringing. Her rebellious nature and alignment with Mia represent the little fires that threaten to disrupt the orderly life of the Richardson family. The custody battle over Mei Ling Chao, a Chinese-American baby, introduces another layer of complexity to the narrative. This conflict not only divides the community, but also forces the characters to confront their biases and the implications of their well-intentioned interventions. In the end, the characters in Little Fires Everywhere are not merely characters in a novel. They are complex individuals, each grappling with their own set of challenges, desires, and secrets. They are mirrors reflecting the themes of privilege, identity, and motherhood, forcing us to reflect on our own biases and societal norms. As we navigate the intricate web of connections and conflicts that Celeste Ng weaves, we find ourselves engrossed in the narrative, captivated by the vivid portrayals of these characters. Their stories resonate with us, challenging our perspectives and prompting us to question our own beliefs. Their connections and conflicts keep readers engrossed until the final page. The title itself, Little Fires Everywhere, serves as a metaphor for the small actions that can lead to significant shifts in our lives. This profound statement holds a mirror to the multifaceted reception of the book. The literary world welcomed Ung's masterpiece with open arms, showering it with praises for its intricate storytelling and its insightful exploration of complex themes. Critics and readers alike lauded the novel for its nuanced depiction of privilege, identity, and motherhood. Its resonance with readers catapulted it to bestseller lists, turning it into a cultural phenomenon. The New York Times praised it as a deft exploration of societal norms and the price we pay for challenging them. Celeste Ong was commended for her ability to weave a narrative that is as thought-provoking as it is engaging, creating a tapestry that is as intricate as the human relationships it portrays. The book's popularity and relevance led to its adaptation into a television series, further expanding its reach and impact. The series, starring Reese Witherspoon and Carrie Washington, brought the vivid characters and the meticulously planned community of Shaker Heights to life, adding a new layer of interpretation to Ung's narrative. The adaptation was met with critical acclaim, garnering praise for its faithful representation of the book's themes and its powerful performances. Within the broader literary landscape, Little Fires Everywhere has carved a significant place for itself. It stands as a testament to the power of literature in sparking conversations about societal issues. It is not just a novel, it is a catalyst for dialogues about the complexities of privilege, identity, and the often undiscussed aspects of motherhood. The book serves as a reminder of the ripple effects our actions can have, the little fires that can ignite significant shifts in our lives and societies. Its impact goes beyond the pages, seeping into our consciousness and encouraging introspection. How does Little Fires Everywhere contribute to discussions about privilege, identity, and the complexities of modern family life? It does so by holding a mirror to our societal constructs, challenging us to look beyond the surface and question the norms we often take for granted. Indeed, Little Fires Everywhere is not just a novel, it is a vivid tapestry of human relationships, societal norms, and the intricate dance of privilege, identity, and motherhood. Celeste Ung's masterful storytelling takes us on a journey through the meticulously planned community of Shaker Heights, introducing us to characters that are as complex as they are compelling. The novel's exploration of privilege unravels the threads of societal expectations, while the portrayal of motherhood challenges us to reflect on the broader implications of defining this role within a narrow framework. At the heart of the narrative, the custody battle over Mei Ling Chao serves as a poignant mirror to our society, demonstrating the aftermath of well-meaning interventions. 
In essence, Little Fires Everywhere ignites important discussions about identity, race, and class, while challenging us to reflect on our own perceptions and biases. Join me as we navigate the little fires that burn within these pages, igniting conversations about the profound themes that make Celeste Ong's work a compelling and relevant contribution to contemporary literature.